This is a surprise face of the Communist Party of Russia's campaign for parliamentary elections this fall. His name is Jeff Monson, the St. Paul, Minnesota native, who's a mixed martial artist and a vowed anarchist, is a big star in Russia. People, you know, say, well, why did you choose Russia? And I, I say, well, I think Russia chose me. Now, the Communist Party hopes he can attract young voters to its cause, long seen as a haven for aging voters nostalgic for the Soviet past. we must support our local police. Nothing can be quite so damaging to police morale and efficiency as converting every arrest into a trial of the policeman instead of the criminal. Now in passing, ladies and gentlemen, you may have wondered why the Communist Party has been a staunch supporter of the drive to place a black studies curriculum into our high schools and colleges. Well, the reason becomes obvious the minute you take a look at the textbooks and the study guides. Under the guise of academic balance, these courses have become a brilliant device for conditioning young people to accept still one more part of the total program for revolution. We must discover the identity of those individuals, both above and below, who consciously are furthering the communist program for revolution, and then remove them from their positions of trust and leadership. Now, of course, the minute you begin to think along these lines, you'll become the target of a whole barrage of attacks. You'll be called a right-wing extremist, a fascist, or at least a dictator. Some years ago, I happened to attend a meeting where several anti-communist refugees from behind the Iron Curtain were called upon to relate their personal experiences. One of the refugees spoke up and he said, you know, I came to America expecting to find a nation of free men, but instead, I find exactly the same thing. Everywhere I look, I see men and women who know that communists are making headway in this country. Correct. 
It wasn't until you pointed your gun at him, advanced on him, with your gun, not your hands down, pointed at him, that he fired, right? Correct. 